for example, I'm now coming to the end of my session on the body. So I need to say something to link this session with the next. So I will say, well, I think that cover more of most of the points about organizing the body. So I'd like to move on to look at how you can introduce your presentation. Okay, we've looked at how you plan how to plan presentation and we've seen that deciding on the presentation's purpose is important. That we also should cons we also should consider our audience and their needs and the context of or and the context or setting of the talk and finally I look briefly at the organization. Okay, I'm going to focus on uh, how you should deliver the, your presentation. And uh, <clears throat> first, I will first come with the um, introductions and conclusions. And then uh, I will show you the differences of uh, written and spoken English, how they affect your presentation. And uh, finally, I will come to the whistle eggs and uh, body language and how you sh use the Q and A section to um, like um, have a effective presentation. So, any questions? Yes, I was wondering what we can do if we get a hard question or a question we can't answer. Oh, that's a hard question. Okay. 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 Uh, right, okay. Uh, uh, give, give a little time to think uh, before you say something. Mm. And uh, just, uh, just, just say something. Uh, say what you think of. It's okay. Yeah, surprise. Yeah. So it's right. Yeah.